above, guys. Uh, and look, face you haven't seen in a while. There's little John, camera mom's got the camera. We got some fishing poles on this cloudy, overclass cloudy, cloudy day. Watch out for the babies. This is our first time fishing this uh, this year, and we wanted to bring you along for the uh, experience. And we're just at a local park. Watch we're out the for the baby, babies. Little baby ducks. I told you watch out for them. I didn't hit them. They they fine. They're like little puppies. Look little how long, adorable. Long neck dinosaur puppy. But that's look. This is like Bob the Raptors. Uh, Raptor little children. Children. Bob, did you do something? Or Joe, guys, check out that channel at Bob the Raptor. Pretty cool guy. Pretty cool channel. Uh, we're out here fishing. It's a cloudy day. We don't know if it's gonna rain again. Uh, we have not like supposed about, to until one o'clock. Yeah, not supposed to until one. So we want to get out here and get some. We get some fishing in. This is a little overflow area of this state park. This is in Evansville here of a state park in Evansville. And this little overflow area. No, this is just another lake. Well, it's an overflow area. You see that little drainage there? That runs across the road. And when that one gets too high, it kind of relieves its pressure into here and oh. it trickles down. So sometimes you get lucky in this little overflow area and catch some fish. We got some night crawlers and some big red worms we're gonna use. And uh, I would use artificial bait. I like to lure fish and, and try to catch some bass, but I'd rather do that on a boat than on the bank. So if Bubba, I'm on the bank- try to stay out of the mud. If I'm on the- Did you just tell him to stay no, out of the mud? No, no, I'm meaning, I'm meaning he's walking in the it's puddles. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> he's walking in the deep well there's puddles. a lot of puddles there really is here I, move away from the ducks so not making them not move making them go somewhere else look there's a little pond out here we can fish in that one no maybe i should right there i guarantee it there's something in there no yeah Turtles. bugs yeah <laughs> but anyways guys we're gonna uh we're gonna walk up to this area and uh the next time you see us we'll have our poles in the water and maybe we'll give you a little bit more communication talk to you guys and maybe, hopefully, one of the scenes you'll actually see us reeling something in, which is pretty cool. So, guys, the reason why we do all these different type of videos on our channel, we do, uh, we've done a scratching lottery thing twice now. One of them was live. If you didn't get to see that, you can go back and look at our live streams. That was pretty cool. We do cooking. We do food reviews. Camera Mom does some makeup review things for uh, Birch Box and Ipsy, Ipsy and Boxy Ipsy, Charm. Boxy Charm. We do all this stuff because we don't want to be just one dimensional channel and we're trying to reach multiple different type of people and which we have been thanks to uh, VA Scratch Kings and Scratch uh, Scratch Off Kings and uh, James Guy Guy for all them type of people. They really introduced us to different people which is pretty cool and uh, we really appreciate it. So those are great channels you guys should definitely check out too. And oh look at a turtle. To... Do you see a turtle? Where? Right here. Where? No it's just a shell. It's just a shell. Look at that. YouTube, we didn't do anything harmful to this turtle or nothing. We found Canadian. The these are Canadian. These are uh, foreign worms, right They're there. They're night crawlers. <laughs> They're night crawl. They're foreign though. They got all. Where we got dancing rascals. How come we don't have? Night yeah, they're monsters. How come these are not? I don't like the night crawlers. How come they're just not here from the United States? Why? What's going on? Why do we have to go to Canada to get night? Well, that doesn't make any sense. They're huge, bub. They're huge. Let's go. Like, pull one out. And uh, this is some people <laughs> would deem this very harmful and not nice uh to the worm don't drop it and which i feel <laughs> i feel your opinion and that's your opinion but unfortunately it's what people do for fishing they this is what they use they use these or minnows uh or these legs don't like the fish and these legs don't like the fake things no these these fish in here don't are, wipe that on your in your these, pocket the fish in oh, here yeah. really like this look at this bill dance bill dance is a great great what do we got there little baby worms but they're they're little they're called dancing rascals because when they get in the water they like activate man they get crazy right they they're start dancing because they're so cold there's like boogie nights they're not moving now but i'm telling you once we get them in the water they'll boogie night it up let me try some i'm gonna do the dancing rascals i think ruby and uh, what are you john, gonna use john I'm gonna use the, you're gonna use the big, the big guy line in that didn't go very far no i didn't go very far I don't have much weight on there, so it's good though. This is good. But look, <laughs> already. Look at that. Guys, guys. <laughs> you literally just threw that in. I just threw that out there, and it's a baby cat. Now, 
This guy is gonna fin me. I know he is. Let me take off my ring. Do you want your glove? No, I don't need my glove for this small guy. Okay, you just want to come up. He's gonna fin the crap out of me. All right, what you want to do is you want to hurry up with these little smackaroos. Okay. He's slimy. See right there when I grab a hold of his fin like that? Now he can't fin me because I've paralyzed him basically. Don't. Sorry, YouTube. I'm not trying to hurt the catfish. I want to get his hook out. There we go. Cleaning out. I'm not going to kiss him because of Corona. I'll go like a fake kiss. But anyways, there it is. Little bitty dude. Whoa, dude. Cool, man. We caught a fish. All right. We got to get him back in the water. There we go. I just threw it out there. I know it was tiny, but you know what? Hey, we already caught a fish. One for me. <laughs> already threw it and just threw I it just in the threw water. It out there, and it did not. He said, "Another little guy." Did you get that? Yeah. Did you get it? Ooh. I was playing a little joke to her. I, I told the little Johnny, oh. "Come right there, right by the, uh, just by this drain entrance right here." Hold and this real quick. Little That's two little guys, guys. Two little guys. Let me pull my stuff. Around. Okay. Hold on, teach him how to do him. All right. Oh, that's by his eye. No, what you want to do is there's Let's two stop. dots. There's two dots do right there. Do you want there. me to stop? No, right here. There's two dots right here. And all you got to do is squeeze them down, and you can get the hook out real easy. Real tiny. I'm sorry, guys, that we're catching tiny fish, but he's still a fish. Bye-bye, buddy. Be careful. Have a good swim. He's back in the water. That was like a little bluegill, little sunfish. I believe it's a bluegill, though. Um, or it could have been a red ear, red ear, but I, I think it was a bluegill. That's what that was. I'm sorry they're so tiny. Guys, I, I we will catch bigger fish, I promise, okay? But I just wanted to show them. We were getting ready to move to go over to the big lake, and I said, watch, I'll just reel it in, and we were right here. Right, right here there. where I've got mine. See it? See right there where camera mom was? We were about right there, and did you? how much did you get of the recording? I don't know. I, I told, got the whole thing. Okay, I told camera mom to start recording, and boy, he took it right there and just went off. So that's, hey, hey, that's two. That's two for... That's two for local John, two fish, okay? We're catching, we're catching uh, bait fish. Like you could take this fish that we're catching now and uh, you could take them to a, a bigger lake, a stripper pit or, or a river and you could cut these up into pieces and use them as bait. That's what we could be doing. So, all right guys, we will be right back. We're gonna walk on over. We'll be back. Okay guys, we have switched. There's camera mom and John. We have switched from over there. That's where we were at. We walked across the road back over to this way. And now we're here. And uh, we're getting ready to cast out again. There's the bait. My po. Now look, guys. We're in a situation where there's a lot of trees around us. So when you cast out here, you're going to have to do like a little sidearm cast. Which means you're going to have to flick out your pole this way and go that way. And you don't want to go up because your line would hit these trees. Okay? You're in an area with a lot of trees. You've got to just kind of... Lower your cast. You're not going to go way up here. You're going to keep it here. And you're going to try to get underneath all those trees right there. Those tree limbs. So you don't... Just like that. And I kind of end up curving it because I had to hook it. So we'll see if we catch something out there. John, you see where the bobber's at? Woo! It's pretty far out there. Not too far, but it's on the, the side here. So maybe we get something swimming, swimming along the banks and might be able to catch that. So we're going to stay here for about... Oh, 15 minutes or so. If we don't catch them, we'll move to a different location. So next time, John's got something. Keep Look. Pulling. Whoa. Oh, he's big. He's got a big fish. Keep pulling. Pull it up. A lot bigger than what I've caught so far. Now bring up on the bank. That's heavy. There it is. Look at that. I couldn't get Keep to the camera quick enough. The water. There he is. Here, camera mom, grab that real quick. He's a little bit bigger. Okay, I got your pole. He's a little bit bigger. And I tell you what, these I got fish, the pole. I got the pole. Let go. These catfish okay, can let go. you pretty good. So, look, if you get gloves on, you don't have to worry about that little trick. But the little trick is, like I said, you got to come Get down up, there and watch. You got to come up behind that fin right there. And you raise that fin up. And then he can't fin you with those fins. But I like to put a hook. I like to put a glove on with a little bit bigger fishes. Okay, now we got to get his hook out safely. Good job, Bubba. We'll open his mouth up. Oh, he's, he's stubborn. Squeeze. Okay, there we go. Now we're gonna keep your mouth open for me. Out there, I got him out. He's still moving. John's gonna get him back in the water. Get him back in the water, son. There he goes. Woohoo! Swims off. Good catch by John there. Yeah. Bigger fish than what I caught. Um, so far, fish. John's the winner of the day. No, no, I've caught two. He's only caught one. So weight, weight matters more. I, I know. Come along. You try your best. <laughs> with uh, what you have to get the hook out of his mouth. He's calling then, for mama. 
You try your best to get John, the hook out of the mouth. he's going right at your string. I don't know if he knows what to do. Yes, he does. Oh, look at it. All right, guys. Oh, he's so fuzzy. We caught, a little, we caught a bigger fish there, but I do think we need to move. Let's move to a different area. What do you guys think? You want to move? Sure. All right. Is that good? John, come here. Come here, guys. I just saw camera mom throw. We were in a new area. We were over there. Show them where we were at. Can you show them? Show them where we were at. Keep it straight. Whenever you're running to show, look. John, look at me. I caught a fish. There it goes. Oh. Another one. Oh. Uh. Dust. Yeah. No, he's not big. Not big, but bigger than the other one I caught. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I fell. I fell. <laughs> okay, let me get his hook out real quick. It's another catfish. Another catfish. Plenty of catfishes. Once again, always hold right there. You should be able to get his hook out pretty easy. I struggle with it sometimes. There we go. Easy and quick. Kiss him. Oh, yeah. Please Daddy's subscribe. Under my screen. <laughs> Please subscribe. Please comment down below. We get the hooks out as fast as we can. We do not want to hurt oh, these fish. Oh, oh. We enjoy catching them, and so far, no keepers, but we're having fun. What a slip sound effect. Woo! There we go. Okay. I'm going to cast out, and we'll be back. All right, guys. Hey, guys. This is it. This is our last spot we're going to be at. We came back to our trusty little overflow area. I don't know if you can see my bobber. It's, it's, it's right there. There it is. Floating out there. We went back to Bobber's. We tried over there at the big lake. And we caught two fish out there, but the wind was just too bad over that way. And we went to non-Bobber's for a little bit of bottom and no luck. Can we just come back over here to finish up? If we catch something, you'll see it. There's John down there. If we catch something, you'll see it. Otherwise, you'll see us next time with an outro. All right, guys. Local John, 1812. We are about to be out of here. Oh. Uh, we went over there. We didn't catch anything, uh, so that's why you're seeing it out. I almost had a big bite, though. Yeah, I had a bite, but he I didn't took catch it anything. and it was heavy. Yeah, and John, but then he, he let it go. John, I think John had a little nibble too. We just didn't catch anything. So, but uh, today total, we caught four fish and uh, two little tiny bitty guys by me, and then another medium sized guy by me, and then John caught a little bit bigger than mine. Uh, one of them. So we caught four fish. <laughs> And uh, they were all catfish besides one. One was either a red ear or a bluegill. I believe it's a bluegill, though. Um, and so that's what we caught today. And we're finishing out. Guys, this is just uh, episode one of uh, One Come All, uh, Big or Small Fishing Adventures with the family, okay? So we're going to have an episode two. We might even go tonight after five. Uh, we will definitely record it. Dinner we time. May, we may not upload it though until thursday or friday so just be looking for episode two of fishing please trust us we're going to catch bigger fish today this is not a place where you expect to catch big fish mm -hmm. is it this is just a family fun walking around place not many weeds and stuff to worry about or big old branches and stuff but we're going to go places like that trust me we will but until then guys i hope you like this video subscribe please if you have not subscribed yet go ahead and hit that subscribe button hit the bell so you get notified next time we do another video like this or a birch and box. All no select all notifications. Yeah, so that way you know if we're doing birch box, food review. I still don't know if I'm going to do a food review tonight or I'm going to count this one as my upload. I don't know. I might do a food review. We've always done that. So maybe we will, maybe we won't. We got to eat anyway. So, all right, guys, that's all we have. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share. Johnny, anything? No?